Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. Driver has been shot and killed by his passengers outside a 7-Eleven in Linwood. The search is on for the two suspects who took off in the victim's car. Eyewitness News reporter Ashley Mackey is live in Linwood with the latest, including a reaction from the victim's wife. Ashley. Colleen, that's right. A tragic story out of Linwood. A family man gunned down by his own passengers during a routine Uber ride. We're standing outside a 7-Eleven on the corner of Fernwood Avenue and Imperial Highway where the victim's body was found. Family and friends still processing the news. 38-year-old Aaron Orozco was the father of two, a nine-year-old boy and a three-year-old girl. He was a veteran. He served four years in the Marines. His wife says he'd been an Uber driver full-time for about four years. When she spoke with him around 10 p.m. Thursday evening, she had no idea it'd be their last conversation. We found out around 2 a.m. this morning um, that he was shot and killed here at this 7-Eleven by two passengers um, during an Uber ride. At around 1.30 Friday morning, during a routine Uber ride, sheriffs say Orozco and his two passengers got into a fight after stopping in a parking lot. They say one of the suspects pulled out a gun and shot Orozco. Then both men fled the scene in Orozco's car. Orozco died at the scene. He said that there were incidences where he felt unsafe, but he said um, overall he never had anything, any occurrences where he felt like his life was in danger. Um, and then, you know, this happened, so this was totally unexpected. The abandoned vehicle was located a short distance away, and the two suspects are still on the loose. In a statement, an Uber spokesperson said, Our hearts are with Mr. Orozco Figueroa's family as they cope with this unfathomable tragedy, and we have reached out to offer our condolences. We have banned the rider's account and are working with police on their investigation. I just really hope that they find them um, because, you know, they created this um, chaos in my life, in my in my family's life, and you know now I'm I don't have my husband with me, and it's just has changed my life around. So I really hope that they do catch them, and they bring them to justice. Orozco's wife say they lived here in Linwood for about 10 years, but they were looking to move because they say they've noticed the city getting more and more dangerous. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.